Holy shit, that's a lot of zombies. Yeah, I remember playing the first Dead Rising and being impressed with how many zombies they had on the screen, man. But that really has nothing on this game, which I mean it shouldn't, because that game is insanely old at this point. Okay, I need to stop by a safe house. Safe house is located north. But really, the first Dead Rising had like some of the worst graphics ever on the original Xbox, or the Xbox 360, I mean. But just the fact that they could cram so many zombies on the screen was just amazing at that time because I don't believe any game before that had ever had so many characters on the screen at once. It was truly spectacular at the time. Okay, how the hell do I get in this safe house? If I remember correctly, I had all kinds of issues getting in here the first time. Um, obviously, I need to go up. Uh, I don't suppose you can jump up that. No, you cannot. How about up that? No. That way? No. Fails everywhere. Um, oh, hey, vodka. Fancy that. Because if I'm going to go... This is definitely not the right way. How the shit do I get up there? Like, obviously I need to get up the scaffolding somehow, right? Um... I want my epic combo weapons back. But obviously if I can't figure out how to get up there, then... I will just need to be moving along, cause... Oh. It's an open window. <laughs> <laughs> oh, video games, you never fail to make me feel like a dumbass. Okay, that is my... Ah, there we go. Weapon locker. Hell yeah. Where are my super awesome combo weapons of victory? Okay. No, no, no regular Grim Reaper. No tactical Reaper. I want my ultimate Reaper. And electro fire staff or electro ice. I generally like fire better, but since that is already a fire weapon, I shall go for the ice staff just for variety's sake. And obviously, I don't need the propane tank. And I shall combo them bitches up. And now we should be good to take on. Mr. Psychopath. Alright, so I should just be able to head east and hopefully end up there before I run out of time. Hopefully I don't actually have to beat him in the time limit and I just have to activate his mission or whatever. And... Oh shit! There we go. Yes. This is probably as good an area to get out and hoof it as any. And if anybody has any requests for like outfits they'd like me to wear, you can totally feel free to make those requests even though it's a little bit late in the game. So for all I know, I, I'm going to end up finishing the story this session and... Obviously, there won't be much, but I could play through and get, like, alternate endings or something. So, yeah, if anybody has any requests for hideous shit I should wear, feel free to ask. And I will try to oblige. It's a pimp-ass pad you got here, Mr. Psycho. Finally, I've been calling the service for days. Service? Are you okay? Yeah, the help took off days ago. You're, like, super late, and I'm not okay, okay? I need you to run down to the store and get me uh, some batteries for the remotes and a uh, bag of chips. Sir, yes, sir. I heard you might have a key to the armory. That's what I'm looking for. Ooh, nice. There's a zombie outbreak going on. Do you even know anything about this? Nope. Uh, I think it's around here somewhere. Been inside playing oh. video games the whole time. Yep, there it is, right there. Great. Can you come give it to me? <laughs> 
you give me that key. I'll beat There's that ass. An armory that can keep dozens of people alive. Dozens. Actually, you know what? I think I'm gonna need a little downtime. You know, all this talky talk is just. <gasps> totally, dude. I know what you're saying. Oh my god, he's got tactical RCs. Okay, I'm going to switch to my ice staff then because. My dad paid for that. Oh, that's so sad. Since this actually can shoot stuff out. Seems like it would be the best option at the current yeah, juncture. That really brings me down. Ah, open up, goddammit. Uh, oh, disable the security panels. Alright. Hopefully I can accomplish that. I make no guarantees, but I will try my best this time. I don't know why you're bothering me. Ah, there we go. Um, I kind of think you should stop that. <laughs> Okay, I really want to up the brightness because everything inside just seems... Oh, yeah, I guess, because there we go. I can't see him there, and I can see him there. So, for some odd reason, I don't know, maybe it's the system update that just yeah. came out for the TV. good old Xbox or something. Oh, sorry. Did you want something? People out there need that key! Oh my god, there's zombies invading your home, sir! Oh, did I? Oh no, they're both upstairs, okay. Like, did I accidentally pass by a. security box? Where's the power? Yeah, I am totally just ignoring all your RC helicopters Why of doom. Can't you just let me nap? I know, I'm so inconsiderate of your nap time. Such a dick I am. Turn it back on. Aww. I'm gonna kill you just because you're such a whiny little bastard, man. Obviously a spoiled rich bastard at that too. So is this actually gonna be a fighter? No, 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 please. Don't hurt me. <laughs> Dude. Calm your, ew, calm your tits, my man. <laughs> Is he Holy dying? Shit. Oh, are you pooping yourself? You may have changed your diaper while I'm here. That is, ew, there's like poop on the ground. Ew. Well, that was the easiest psycho fight ever. And I got an achievement. What is the name? Slothful. That, oh, I got the police station armory key. Nice. That is pretty fucking gross, my man. Dear God almighty. And I can't abuse your corpse. It is always incredibly disappointing when I can't abuse someone's corpse. I am all about that sweet, sweet corpse abuse. Oh my God, I should not have jumped off there. But it got me to another blueprint, so. Ooh, party gloves. Sounds delightful. Damn, I got so many combo weapons, boxing gloves, and toy robots. Alright, and there's the gloves and the toy robot. Oh, oops. Oh, wait. Did I. Oh, okay, I do have them both. <laughs> right on! Right on! Test these bad boys out! head to some other area which I should figure out where I'm headed first for oh yeah I forgot I got a I got one one point for beating the chapter okay got five more and then on to oh wow I'm only five levels away from level 50 and then on to the level 50s uh, investigate the kill get to the karaoke bar obviously I'm not doing that yet since I have optional objectives um Oh, there we go. Alright, that is really close, so I guess I shall do that. And the stupid connect is listening to me and doing stuff that I don't want to do. And then... 
soon? I don't know. I might head down to the Psycho or I shall. Ah, there we go. Or I shall. Ah, there's like a collectible up there. Damn it, he had a collectible in his home that I did not collect. I must collect my collectible before I can proceed. Even though I have no idea where this is actually located. Give it about five seconds of effort and if I am unable to find it, I shall continue on my journey. Yeah, yeah your door better not be locked. Probably more than likely going to be upstairs. Because nothing in this game is ever located on the bottom floor. Ever. Never, ever, ever, ever. Ah, there we go. Yoink. Nice. Only got eight statues left. Hell yeah. Okay. Onward to a sad mission we go. Oh, and you have... Aw, oh, that car is fucked up. Is, you have no idea how disappointed I am by that. You really wanted to steal your pimp ass ride and drive it the hell out of here. Whatever. I should really get back on the main road, not just keep running through all these back alleys. And oh, hey, you lived right next door to the psycho douchebag that tried to feed me to his family. Wow. He's just an entire neighborhood of assholes. Who'd have thunk it? The rich neighborhood is full of assholes. Oh yeah, I haven't even tried out my weapon yet. Yeah, it looks like there's someone I need to rescue over here, so I shall use my weapons when I rescue them. Or not. Sir, you alright? What, are you locked out of there? Locked out? Ah. That's a good one. Sonny, how'd you like to make a deal, huh? Well, that depends, but go ahead, tell me more. I'm a good, honest working man. You could tell, right? Well, I was gonna retire today thanks to a will that's somewhere in that house. Oh, yeah. I'll get it for you. Just go inside and get it. I would, but I tried. I did. You see, the house is overrun with those dead bastards. No idea how they got in, but anyways, I don't have it in me to face them that back, you know, but if you do, I'll reward you handsomely, son. How about it? You reward me with a blowjob, good sir? You got a deal. Good on you, kid. Go get that will. I'll be waiting right here for you. You know, I didn't even realize I had rubber duckies stuck to my fists. <sighs> Hadn't actually looked at the gloves since I had equipped them. Oh, you're getting your ass beat by rubber duckies. <laughs> yeah, I'm really not like a... <laughs> okay, maybe I'll have to change my mind after this. <laughs> I was about to say I'm not like the biggest fan. Okay, these are terrible weapons. I can literally sit there punching them forever with that move and they don't die. Can you actually die by this? Oh, okay, they do eventually die. Holy shit. Wow, that is terrible. Terribly, terribly, terrible. Uh, what the hell am I trying to do? Beat your ass with some knowledge, zombie bastards. Okay, enough dicking around with that. Because that is just not doing it for me. I realize it is a basic combo weapon and not an advanced combo weapon, you know, so I shouldn't really expect anything too terribly great out of it, but still. When I got this in my inventory versus those gloves, yeah, it's, it's there's no contest. Dick! Thanks, man. I thought I was a goner. Wait, what's going on here? You were locked in here with these zombies? My stepfather wants my mother's will. She left it all to me. Oh. The greedy coward lured the zombies in, then locked me in. Evil. If I died, he'd be worth the Bastard. But I figured he'd try something, so I planned ahead. Look at my butt cheeks in the mirror. Lucky for you, I came along, Talk I guess. to you. I'll let you in on a secret. I set up that lousy money-grabbing jerk with the fake will. I got the real will with me. Huh. Looks like there's only one way to deal with this. I kill you and take it all. 
Reunite Warren and Phil. Alrighty. As soon as I gobble down some delicious soda. I did not mean to randomize that. I wanted to drink it. There we go. Actually, since there's some alcoholic beverages out here in the kitchen area, I should probably make myself another delicious combo cocktail. And yes, as you can tell, I'm still getting used to the controls again, because... Uh, ah, there we go. That's the one I wanted. And then I should take a little drink for the road. Glug, glug, glug. And... Got any more? Ah, there we go. And one more drink, just so I don't actually have to use my... My, uh... Combo drink first. Alright, you two fight it out. Ah, or hug it hey, out. Asshole. Funny how you forgot to mention the poor kid trapped inside. Asshole. Feels off. Mm. Poor kid. Mm -mm -mm. Do you break? He's loaded. And if his bitch of a mother was dumb enough to marry me, then I deserve that money. True that. Sorry, kid, but I guess my only option out of this BS is to get rid of all the witnesses. Not according to my epic rubber ducky hands. I shall beat that ass. Oh, damn, he is fucking me up. Whatever. Why'd your mom marry that loser? She went to buy a car and came back with him. Worst day ever. But I guess it's finally over now. She went to buy a car and came back with a husband. Your mom is a whore.